How you doing guys? Hey. Uh, today is uh, Friday. The 16th? Yeah, of November. I couldn't remember the month for a second. <laughs> um, got a couple of pickups to show you of what we got this week. And uh, we're going to open them all up and show you what we got. Um, it's going to be stuff from Big Lots this week. One eBay package. One package from Bull Moose. And one package from Cinema Man. Um, from Instagram and YouTube and um, Cinema Sicknesses mm -hmm. videos. So we're going to go through everything and show you what I got. I'm excited because I couldn't wait. So I already peeked. So yeah, go it's going to be her first unboxing. Oh. We'll put this off the side for right now. Uh, first thing I'm going to show off is everything from Big Lots. Marie doesn't know what I bought yet because I pretty much picked them up today. I went over there. They were having a buy one, get 50% off on kids' toys. And I wanted to get a couple of things for my son for Christmas. So while I'm there, I'm going to look at movies. Plus, there were some titles that Cinema Man and Cinema Sickness found on their last Big Lots video that I was looking for, so I definitely wanted to go there. So she's going to pull them out of the bag and hand them to me, and it'll be the first time that she sees them all, so. Okie dokie. Thank you for prearranging these in the bag. Yeah, so the first, uh, we're going to do the DVDs first, then the Blu-rays. So the first one is <laughs> The Good Lie. How can a lie be good? With, uh... <laughs> Reese Witherspoon. It was on clearance for a dollar fifty. I'm a fan of Reese Witherspoon. You probably know. Yeah, so am I. And I've never seen this movie, so I had to pick it up. Kate Hudson. Yeah, this is something borrowed. Again, I think I've seen this one before, but I really don't remember it. But it has uh, Kate Hudson. Uh, Jennifer Goodwin, um, John Krasinski, and Colin Egglesfield, if I'm correct. And I enjoy the cast. It, it has a, you know, decent cast in it. In fact, like I said, I like rom-coms, so it was something I wanted to check out. There you go. Oh, yeah. Next <laughs> one is uh, 86 Kill. It's a uh, IFC... Midnight film, Scream Factory. I didn't own this, and it was a title that they actually put out early, if you could see right there, $1.88. It was one of their Black Friday ones. It actually showed up, so I decided to scoop that one up because it's horror, it's Scream Factory, and it's $1.88. This looks horror. From the producer of Paranormal Activity and The Purge. Yeah. Um, I, if I remember right, somebody else picked this up at one of the big lots in one of the videos I watched, but uh -huh. I can't remember who picked it up, but it has, uh, Jessica Alba in it, The Veil, so it was something that looked pretty interesting, so I wanted to pick that up, but uh. give it a shot. <laughs> this movie, I always, I've seen it. It was pretty good. And um, horror. it's horror. It's based on a true story. And I always pass on it because I never find it cheap. But it's, um, I found it for $1.88. It's uh, The Exorcism of Emily Rose. Like I said, I enjoyed this one. And uh, I don't think I've seen it. I'm trying to remember what her name is. Surprise. It's uh, b -b 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 Jennifer, Jennifer Carpenter. That she was uh, the sister on Dexter. Uh, she really played a good role in this. So I really enjoyed it. I wanted it for my collection. So I finally got that in my collection. That's for your collection too. Well, this is for my collection. <laughs> You're going to enjoy that one. <laughs> I saw this and my son likes Thomas the Train and Bob the Builder. So I got this 
double mm-hmm. feature, Halloween, uh, spooktacular, and trick or treat yeah. has Barney, but eh, a be, little one year old will enjoy that. Yeah, it'll be something <laughs> for him to stare at. So I grabbed that for him while I was there. Ooh. This I actually already have it in I my was collection. Just say, don't you already have that? But I remember when I watched this. What we watch it every Christmas. Yep. And uh, if I remember, mine had a scratch on it, and it yeah. skipped. And I think we had to jump. Yep. We had to jump a scene. So I found it in the clearance for two dollars and fifty cents, and that's the family stone. You are right. And every time we put it in the player, it's like. Duh. Yeah, and it makes me so mad. And like I said, I love this movie. It's a great Christmas film. Classic. And it's a, it's a nice rom-com kind of tearjerker. So if you like that kind of things, you know, I would say definitely check it out. It has a great cast. Sarah Jessica Parker. Oh, I like Dylan it. Dylan uh, Milroney. Um, Craig T. Nelson. Uh, Diane Keaton. Uh, Clara Danes. It's, like I said, a great movie. Highly say check that one out if you haven't. I don't think they um, can hear the snoring bulldog, but wow. We got uh, Blu-rays now. Okay, Blu-rays. now we're going to Blu-rays. This one. Keep it clean. I found it <laughs> in the clearance again for a dollar. This was a dollar fifty. It's uh, the 40 year old virgin who knocked up uh, Sarah Marshall and felt super bad about it. He's 41 though now. Yeah. So, yeah. did I say 40 or 41? You said 40. Oh. That's okay. 41. It's it's, it's a little late. It but looks interesting. I don't have this movie. I like spoof movies. And spoof movies for $1.50 on Blu-ray, that's definitely a pickup. Next one is... That's for you. Yeah. <laughs> They're all for you, buddy. Um, Except one. I didn't have this one. And for a dollar fifty again on clearance, it was uh, a pickup. I have the first movie. I didn't have the second one. I don't think I have any of the other ones either. And that's uh, the Marine Two with Ted DiBiase. <laughs> Decided, yeah, check it out. Like I said, for a dollar fifty. Is it fun watching me see these for the first time? Yeah. That looks cute. This one I have it on DVD, but for three dollars. It was a definite upgrade because when it comes to animated movies, I I prefer them on Blu-ray over DVD. It just looks better. And that's uh, Ant Bully. I know a couple people found these in uh, the $5 dump-in at Walmart. I think it was TD Healthy did. But for $3 at Big Lots... Brand new factory seal. Yeah, that's... A better steal for me, so I'll scoop that one oh, up. Oh, this is an upgrade. Yep, this I have on DVD, and this is one of the titles that Sim of Sickness found, and I'm glad I found it. And that's uh, Turbo, the 3D, Blu ray, Blu ray, DVD with digital copy. It was uh, a must grab. Like I said, I'm trying to get all the 3D movies. The Any little... 3D is a must grab for you. Yeah, if it's 3D and I don't have it, it's a automatic pickup. There's three 3D movies that I really don't want for the collection, but I have to get them, and that's Kenny Chesney live in concert, the Jonas Brothers live in concert. I could see. And Hannah Montana, mm. that all came out in 3D. That sooner or later I'll have to buy them, but those are way at the bottom of the priority list. Kenny but, Chesney's not that down by the bottom, is he? Uh, he's country. But uh, Turbo, that, that was a, a must grab. <gasps> oh, I like that one. There you go. Sorry. This one, <laughs> it's uh, when we were talking back when Cinema Sickness and Cinema Man was here. Cinema Man asked me if uh, we were talking about the Shrek promo set and I didn't think that they did standalone releases well one of the picks that I found one of the movies that I found today actually proved me wrong and that's uh Shrek the third on 3D 3D they actually did standalone releases so 
his Shrek the Third. It had a, it's a two disc combo pack, and I don't know if it had any special features or anything, but I saw it. I like the artwork. I wanted to get the that release of it. You can watch my face and see if it's a 3D or not. <laughs> yeah, this one I have on. Spoiler alert! I have on Blu-ray, but I don't have the 3D version. But this is Mega Mind on 3D. Like I said, I just have the regular Blu-ray, but now I have the 3D with the DVD also. So I'll keep my Blu-ray copy and have the 3D also. I don't know if this has um, the Blu-ray is um, that you can pick to watch it on Blu-ray or Blu-ray 3D. But if it if it doesn't, it's not a big deal. I already have it. Found a few 3Ds. Yeah. Is the is this loose? Oosh, don't shake it if it is loose. This is the only copy they had of this. I Might just, as well. I just felt it. I'm going to show it and then I'll open it up real quick. But this is Kung Fu Panda in 3D. I don't have any of the Kung Fu Pandas. and um, They're good. I've, I've actually seen one or two. I haven't movies. seen any of them. They're good. But... Uh, well, I like them anyway. Now I just gotta find Kung Fu Panda 2, and I know Kung Fu Panda 3 came out in 3D. I'm not positive about 2. She's getting louder and louder. Maybe. But it was the yeah. DVD that fell out. Hopefully, it didn't scratch. But nope. Still mint. Okay. That looks good. But, uh. Oh, I'm slacking. Oh, oh, you're slacking. Next one 3D. 3D also. And that's um, Mr. Peabody and Sherman. This was one that I really wanted to find. And this is the Blu-ray, 3D, Blu-ray, DVD with digital copy. And That's this, the one that I would have picked too. This, this is the first one I actually saw there. And I was like, ooh, this is the one I want. So I was happy to get that one. Again, never seen this movie, but... I haven't I, either. I will shortly. And this has, you know, uh, no special features, but has some bonus material. I don't know what, what it actually is because my eyes are horrible. But uh, it has a couple of special features on the Blu-ray disc, but... Yeah. But... I'm excited to have that one. So that's uh, Mr. Peabody and Sherman. It's pretty much a lot of DreamWorks 3D titles that all showed up. That's it. Any more? No. Nope. Okay. So that's pretty much everything I picked up at Big Lots. That was neat. I didn't know what you grabbed. Um, the next one. You can hold that. Oh, thank you. The next one that I got is from Cinema Man. Cinema Man. Yeah. I always call them it's Cinema Man, but it's, it's cinema, uh, cinema Man. I'll leave a link down below to his Instagram and his uh, YouTube channel. Try to get him to start making videos again. But um, when the Retro Slips came out, there was only two of them that I really wanted. I found one that I showed in last week's video. This is the other one that I wanted, and Cinema Man went to... A Walmart and he actually found six copies of this movie so I he asked me if I still needed it I said yes I do he could spare so, one for you he, he didn't need to hoard up yeah so uh <laughs> he picked me up one so thank you that was nice we made a uh, a little trade that uh He got me this, and I got him a movie, and we just did a pretty much an even swap. So. I forget I did, what it, it is. Oh, this? Yeah. The last. Yeah. I didn't open it. It just came in the mail today, so. Um, ah, packaged really well. It's not lying, huh? It's in, a, <laughs> it's in a bag, in a box, in a bag. It's like a Gennaro's. <laughs> uh, CF's unboxing. Except Chris didn't make his own box. But he's going to make you work for it. Oh yeah, he's making me work for this movie. 
good arm. <laughs> but a box and then a bag. It was the bag, the box, and then the another bag. So we're almost in. It'd be an hour video, just 40 minutes of me opening this. Five up. hours later. <laughs> If I was good at editing, I would put that in, but I sick. Hey, inside of the bag, there's another bag. Well, if it's dented, they got a problem in the post, it's, post office. It's like one of those uh, Russian eggs. It just <laughs> keeps on going in. Chris asked me today if it if it came okay and if it, if it came damaged. I'm like, I don't know. They packaged it. But... <laughs> Chris packaged it extremely bulletproof. Oh, this this is the last one right here. Oh. I could see the movie. I can see the blue. Wow, man. Wow. Oh, You're I'm making it work. But it is mint because of the way he packaged it. So, Chris, I really appreciate oh, it. Oh, he did package it? Oh, yeah, he packaged that. Nice, man. So, uh, this is the one that I wanted, and that's Who's Harry Crumb. It's uh, first time to Blu-ray, and this is the only way you can get it is through this uh, retro slip. So That was worth it. Yeah, but like the other one, uh, Marie's going to have to work on getting that sticker off because I don't want no part of it, but... I'm super excited to have this. I haven't seen this in pretty much when it first came out. I don't remember. What's that say right there? 1989? 1989. Tricer yeah. Pictures. Yeah. So when this came out in 89 is when I seen it. But um, I'm super excited to have this. And it'll be something I'll be watching very shortly. And but, I'll get uh, to watch it for the first time. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Chris. I really appreciate this. You know, you're the man. And uh, like I said, I'll leave links down below to his Instagram and his YouTube channel. Make some videos. Yeah. Make some videos. <laughs> Thanks again. And the next thing is uh, from eBay that uh, Marie, I got Marie as a gift. A little surprise. I couldn't wait. I already yeah. Peeked in. She already peeked in and... Uh, opened it, but it was something for her for her collection because she only collects one thing pretty much. <laughs> so you, if uh, anybody knows, you'll know what's in there. But it is the Bambi Target exclusive. Oh, sorry. And that's the uh, the Digi Book edition. The Blu-ray, DVD, Digital HD, which uh, he gave away. But yeah. I don't need it. We got it like like $10 cheaper. Yeah. And the pages are like really nice. I came with a little picture. Oh. But she's trying to get all the Bambi releases right. and... Um, the pages are like coded. Oh. You can tell I, I do this a lot, right? Yeah. yeah. But, but it's I a just really love this movie. Yeah, and it's like I said, it's the Digi Book. So right now she has the DVD, the, the Platinum Edition. Yeah, the Digi Book and the Zavi Exclusive Steel Book. So we gotta start working on. Gotta see the rabbit. There you go. There's a rabbit. But uh, we gotta start working on getting the other releases. But that was something that she was super excited about. Oh getting. yeah. I am excited. But, here you go. Thank you. And the last thing that I got is... I already saw it and I'm still excited about it. Was, um, I got from Bull Moose. It was a steel book that was coming out on Tuesday. And I looked around. It was not in stores. Best Buy had it for $30. Bull Moose actually had it in store and it was five dollars cheaper so i ordered it pretty much through bull moose because they have rewards also and i used the rewards i had and actually got it for ten dollars cheaper 
So this only actually cost me 15 bucks, but I'm gonna leave a link down below for bull moose. You can pretty much order stuff on line through them if you're not in the Northeast area. And uh, it's free shipping over 30 bucks. So I would highly say check them out. They actually have new and used. And if you watched uh, Summer Sickness's video, when we went there, they have a lot of exclu uh, a lot of boutique items and a lot of obscure stuff. So, you know, I say highly check them out if you're looking for pretty much oddball stuff that you're not gonna find. But I was so excited I forgot to like rattle off the title smoothly of this. And it's okay. But uh, it's the Sharknado collection. I only have, I think, the first two movies, and I think that's all I've ever seen. But this has one through six. Six just coming out on Tuesday. And it's the limited edition six films, including The Last Sharknado. And... It's cheesy a little, but... It's, yeah. It's, it's good. Yeah. yeah. I've actually seen some of them. It has the Sharkaholic cut. Sharks in a tornado? Yeah. That's pretty Sign cool. me up. Isn't he carrying a chainsaw too? Yeah. Nice. It's, it's, yeah. I forgot what his name is. Sign he was the guy up. from uh, 90210. But um, it's, like I said, pretty cool steel book. I haven't really seen anybody get this, but I'm going to crack it open just to show you, you know, what the inside looks like and the back artwork. But this is, let me see if I can open this. Might be a little easier to put this back. Yeah. That's nice. I like the color. Yeah, I the like red it. Red and gray. Sure. Trying to open this gently. I don't want to scratch it. Steel books are very delicate for being called a steel book. Yeah, they're <laughs> pretty much tin books. But, <laughs> tin uh, books. it's has a really nice border along the outside all the way around and uh the shark is embossed and so are the teeth pretty much you know all the lettering the shark the teeth are all embossed the spine's nice too okay. and um this is a spine right there it says sharknado collection and then uh it just has doesn't have a j card or a c card or anything it just has Pretty much a piece of paper that has all the info for all six films. And then the back has the shark inside the tornado. That's cool. But it's pretty much a matte finish. It's it's not really a, a high gloss. It has, but... It's got texture to it. Yeah, it's embossed in the front. And then the inside, oh, nice. it's two discs only for all six films. And let me see if I can figure. Yeah, it has Sharknado. Then the second one is the extended ver it has the extended version. The third one is the exclusive Sharkler, Sharkular edition. The fourth one is the Sharknado edition. And then the fifth one is the extended edition. Then the last one is the Sharkaholic edition. But I'm trying to figure out this one, this one, this one. Okay, so the way it is, is it's two discs. And each disc has three films. But let me take the discs out. And show the interior artwork. Blood. Yeah. Sex for blood. There but you go. That's what it looks like right there. It's pretty much a shark inside of a blood tornado. So that looks pretty cool. And there's the front, back, and spine. And that's the Sharknado collection, pretty much. Let me put these discs back in. Right. 
That's it right there. Okay. But if you're a fan of the Sharknado movies and don't have many of them or you want to get this exclusive steel book. That collector's tin. Yeah. It is a nice piece for your collection. If yeah. You like the well, like I said, Bull Moose has it for $24.99. I highly recommend if you're going to buy it, buy it through them. But that's pretty much everything that we picked up. Ugh. My one, my first one. Her that's one right exciting. there. Oh my god. This one equals like all that and more. I love it so much. Yeah, but comment that's... down below what your favorite one is. Let yeah. us know if um, you've seen and you're like, Nick, don't watch that. Yeah, <laughs> if you've seen any of these and what you think about them. Um, please like this video if you liked it. If you didn't, that's okay also. You can give it a thumbs down, but we'd rather you didn't. Yeah, comment down below about any of the films. And, uh, if uh, you want to see more videos from us, please hit the subscribe button and uh, hit that notification bell. Uh, next week is pretty much Black Friday. I'm going to be going out Thursday night at 1 a.m. in Massachusetts. Uh, Best Buy open, so I'm going to get there. Hit uh, Best Buy and then swing over to Target because it's pretty much right next door. Cause there's one thing that I know that I want from Target. And then on Friday, we're gonna go, the family is gonna <laughs> hit up Walmart and I'll uh, see what movies they have over there. But I wanted to get to Best Buy because Best Buy pretty much has the bulk of what I want there. So uh, stay tuned for those videos. Again, thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.